Good evening, everybody. Um, tonight I'm going to, as you see, be reviewing uh, Duvel Belgian Golden Ale. Uh, now this is a beer that um, has um, it's from Belgium. It's been around since 1871. It's uh, 8.5% alcohol by volume. And uh, it, um, uh, if you live here in New York, uh, you may be familiar with the brand Oma Gang out of Cooperstown. Well, Duvel owns um, Oma Gang. They do Belgian style ales. Um, reading this, it says. Four generations of the Mortgott family uh, have brought together Pilsner malts, Bohemian hops, and a unique yeast strain to create this intense, aromatic, and beguiling ale. This Belgian favorite is best enjoyed chilled um, 40 to 50 degrees Fahrenheit or about 5 to 10 Celsius. With discerning friends or good looking strangers. Store this bottle in a cool, dark place to serve, tip glass, and pour gently. Okay. So, using my uh, pewter fleur de lis shaped bottle opener that I got for Christmas, I'm going to open this bottle and get right to it here. This one takes a little bit more effort than a lot of bottle openers because it doesn't really grip the cat very well, but gets the job done. Okay, so let's pour it right here. Okay. As you can see, it's a uh, poured it rather aggressively, so it's about a four finger amount of head. Very uh, rather dark golden straw color. You can see uh, quite a bit of carbonation coming up from, I guess, from that do that. Well, excuse me about the camera here. Well, the Duvel. Shape D at the bottom of it is generating all these bubbles you see here. Okay, so let's go to the aroma. Hmm. Yeah. Really, it smells just like um, your traditional Belgian ale should. Should you know? Grainy, hoppy, fruity, citrusy almost. What can you say? It's, um, tastes like a Belgian ale should. Or, or smells like a Belgian ale should. Okay, so let's go to the taste. What can you say? It tastes like it smells. Um, it's got um, a little bit of um, bitterness that grabs you right up front. You could, well, it's 8.5. Some alcohol, maybe that grabs you a little bit too. But 
I think it's uh, I think it's the spear Al Harlock said um, at that that strength that you can find yourself drinking too much of these and not even know it. So. Uh, So, but it's very, but it's very good. Um, I think that might add a little bit of that, not the bitterness. I mean, the alcohol may add some uh, harshness to it. So I just knock a little bit off of it for that. But it's absolutely a great beer. Yes, world-class beer. So I think I'm going to give it 4.5 out of 5. Until next time, cheers.